My Philosophy for a Happy Life, Sam Burns' TED Talk. Summary Sam Burns was from Foxborough, Massachusetts and was a young teenager who sadly passed away in 2014 as a result of progeria, an illness that is extremely rare and ultimately fatal. Before he passed away, he delivered a wonderful talk on his philosophy for leading a happy life at the TED conference. Sam was aware that his time on earth was short, and as a result, he made the decision to make the most of his remaining time by experiencing life to its utmost. He spoke openly about the ways in which his experiences had altered his perspective of the wider world. He came to the realization that one of the gifts he had been given was the ability to appreciate the insignificant facets of life, something that the majority of people do not possess. The key to a happy existence, according to Sam, was to forget about the future and enjoy each day to the fullest. This was a straightforward but profound piece of advice. He was of the opinion that putting one's valuable time and effort into worrying about the future was counterproductive. Sam adopted this concept, which allowed him to concentrate on the here and now and to appreciate the beauty that can be found in ordinary life. Sam also urged people to value the time they spent with their families and friends by reminding them to do so. According to him, his parents were the sun and moon of my existence and he regarded them as his closest friends. Sam encouraged others to work toward their own personal development, but he also held the belief that placing an excessive amount of emphasis on achieving one's goals might be counterproductive if it causes one to lose sight of the value of living in the here and now. He stated that rather of focusing on attaining perfection, we should instead concentrate on making progress. In conclusion, Sam provided an original viewpoint on death from which the majority of us have something to gain. He was of the opinion that even though it is a tragic and regrettable aspect of life, death should be acknowledged and accepted for what it is. He encouraged us to view death not as an end to life but as a celebration of life and a reminder to live each day to its fullest potential. The talk given by Sam was quite motivational. His thoughtful and forthright musings on life, death, and the significance of living in the here and now should be taken to heart because they are actually relevant and enlightening. His outlook on how to achieve happiness in life can teach all of us to have a deeper appreciation for life and to make the most of the time we have here on earth.